everybody my name is Rocky Cinema or you can just call me Rockies and in today's video we have another cut commentary for you guys so hopefully you guys enjoy now in today's video what I want to talk about with you guys is we are exactly one month away from the release of Black Ops 3 and I could not be happier we are exactly 31 days away from the release of Black Ops 3 and I am so hyped man you guys should be hyped as well it's gonna be a great game and I could not be happier now one thing I want to point out real quick is that I'm actually doing this cut commentary without a sniper every fucking cut commer in the world has to use a sniper you are not in phase stop trying to be in phase you are not good the only other person that I've seen recently that does not do cut commentaries with a sniper is my buddy Phil or the silent gaming and I, I applaud you Phil I applaud you man stop following the crowd be a leader not a follower now getting back on track we are exactly one month away from the release and so that means in exactly one month's time literally one month I will be playing Black Ops 3 I will be making Black Ops 3 videos and I am so so hyped now for all you little kids out there that are gonna say hey Rockies I'm getting the game early I don't have to wait a month Fuck off. Literally, if you're somebody my size, if you have 1,000 subscribers or less, and you're paying $200 to get Call of Duty Black Ops 3 early, you have a problem. You need to go kill yourself or something, because something is mentally wrong with you. The only people in my mind that are allowed to pay $250 to get Call of Duty three days early is Ali A, T. Martin, Drifter, etc., who will make their money back by making the videos early. If you're paying $250 to get the game early, do you know how much money you're going to make back? Back from those early videos three dollars so suck a dick stop getting the game early if you're gonna get the game early so be it you're getting the game early that's good don't pay two hundred and fifty dollars for it if you have to pay sixty to a hundred that's fine thirty dollars extra isn't too much that's not that big of a deal but if you have to pay two hundred and fifty dollars you are mentally insane now I don't want to sound super fucking hypocritical here but I'm gonna try to get the game early I'm gonna try everything in my power to get the game early if I can get it a few days early I'm gonna be happy that's something that I want to do I've never had that experience before and I want to try it out now there's something that I need your guys's help with I haven't pre-ordered black ops 3 yet and I don't know when I'm gonna pre-order it we are a month away and I haven't pre-ordered it yet so I'm either gonna pre-order it from GameStop or I'm gonna pre-order it from Amazon now if you guys have been around for a couple years you would know that if you pre-order it off of Amazon you sometimes get Call of Duty early the reason being is Amazon gets the game a few days early in their warehouses and they have to ship out orders as soon as they get them so say that you do one or two day shipping from Amazon they're gonna ship it out with one or two day shipping from when they get it in their warehouse so you don't have to be Asian to do the math if you get the game at the warehouse four days early and you have two day shipping you're gonna get the game two days early and that's just how it goes I want to see if that's actually true I want to see if that actually happens now the only problem with that logic is if Amazon actually doesn't get the game early that means that I can get the game during any time of the day on November the 6th you are guaranteed to get it on the release date but you don't know what time you're gonna get it however if Amazon decides that they don't want to get it in their factory for a few days or if they don't want to ship it out early that means that I can get it at you know 6 p.m. on November the 6th which means that I could I basically wasted a day of my life waiting to get the game so I can either pre-order it off of Amazon and take my chances at getting it early or I can know for a fact that I'm getting it at midnight from the midnight release on Oct on November the 6th from GameStop so I don't know man I don't know what I'm gonna do I don't know if I should pre-order it off of Amazon or GameStop but let me know I, I literally I have no idea man I don't know now back to my point am I gonna pay 80 to 100 dollars to get the game early hell no I'm not I'm gonna pay 60 dollars 65 dollars whatever it is online or at GameStop regardless I am paying the normal price because I'm I'm not fucking stupid I'm just I'm not stupid if you have two hundred and fifty dollars to waste and you're you know daddy go fund me daddy's gonna go give you two hundred and fifty dollars to waste on a video game you know go be it more power to you you're gonna get the game early you're gonna waste two hundred and fifty dollars doing it but you're gonna get the game early so that pretty much sums that up if you are getting the game early and you're paying two hundred and fifty dollars for it you are basically a detriment to society and you need to go change your way all right guys that's pretty much it that's been my little rant for today if you guys get the game early you already know what i'm gonna say to you fuck off if you get it early you know fuck off thank you guys for watching this has only been my second cut commentary let me know what you guys think i'm out for the day guys deuce